Today's subscriber of the week is Klatzi Ninja. Thank you for subscribing and if you want to become subscriber of the week, just subscribe and uh, leave down the hashtag SOTW for a chance of being featured here. So let's go. Sheesh, what's up? Today we have another episode of I Rate Your Teams and for that occasion I do have a special kit on. Today uh, this is Fiorentina and it is the legendary Roberto Baggio. Yes. All right, in the last episode, I asked you to improve uh, this team and David Lopez said, for the last team, sell Ter Stegen to get total coins to 100,000, then use the money to buy Tots Courtois and gold Cavajal, sell Lodi to get gold Marcelo, sell Son to get uh, gold Lacazette, and for chemistry and domestic, man of the match, Awa, uh, sell Demele and save up for 85 inform Ben Yedda. Thank you for your suggestions and uh, we, will, we will start the video. So, as I said last time, I I'll just uh, check them out from uh, Twitter from the timeline. The first team is from uh, Der Lelek. He uh, follows me and uh, yeah, this is his team. So we have Ter Stegen, Hakimi, Puyol, uh, Bobby Moore and, and Alonso. In the midfield we have <coughs> Gattuso, Kaison or Kaison. Then we have uh, Witze here. In the front we have uh, Tyram, Plea and Bakayoko. So 200,000 is the budget. He says, hello, Yaya community. That's my team budget, 200 to 250,000 Ter Stegen, Hakimi are tradable thanks hashtag sheesh fifa so what you uh, could do here in this team i would get rid of player personally i'm not a fan of him in fifa so in this team you could perfectly fit in ben Yedda would be a perfect fit with Bakayoko so that would be something uh, that you could do as for the goalkeeper Testegen is nice I don't know about Puyol but well if you have him untradeable then I guess you can play him you could upgrade him to to something like any Bundesliga center back for example Hummels or something like that it would be another option if you have him untradeable then I guess you <laughs> can also play him I like Hakimi personally I play myself so this is a good option I think and uh, yeah overall a good team so let's check out the next one which is from Z. He follows me and says, Hi Sheesh, enjoy your I enjoy your squad reviews and keep up the nice work. Here's my team and I have 300,000 liquid. Entire bench, Za, Pogba, Wan-Bissaka and Ter Stegen are untradables. Alright, so let's uh, check it out. Ingo, we have Ter Stegen, then we have Wan-Bissaka and Nandes, then Varane and Mondi. In the midfield we have Ikone, then Ducouré and Pogba. Up front we have Za, Mbappé and Neymar. What is tradable, what isn't? I have to check again. If we look at this team, entire bench, Za, Pogba, Wan-Bissaka and Ter Stegen are untradables. It's a good goal team I'd say but for 300,000 there's something that you can do so I would not play Pogba at this stage of the game definitely not instead of Pogba you could get Kante for example and also uh, instead of uh, Dukure you could get someone like uh, Sisoko I guess he's a little bit expensive yeah 500,000 so this is something uh, to save up for I guess uh, this is something that you could do uh, as for the defense I wouldn't change anything uh, at this point in the front lineup also not they are also all pretty good I see Dukure has the green link to Za this is something uh, that well will be uh, destroyed if we put in uh, the changes but maybe you could get like a 4-5-1 uh, formation then get Neymar on the left wing on the left mid position Mbappé right next to it yeah surrounded by by the other Frenchies and then you should be good to go and on the right hand side you have Za and Juan Bisaka so this is how you could fit this all in and uh, yeah these would be my thoughts for this team if you have other ideas let us know in the comments down below and we will check out the next team which is from uh, Josh uh, Yoshi uh, he follows me and uh, well doesn't like FIFA but still plays it <laughs> all right I should actually FIFA hi again sheesh I have around 200,000 for upgrades and everyone is untradeable apart from Messi and I don't mind taking out any untradeable players so first pick is how I start and second is in game keep up the good work and thanks PS I have uh, Bustos SPC instead of Semedo all right this is his team we have uh, Van der Zaar, then we have uh, Semedo also Campbell Opara and Carlos in the midfield we have Felipe Anderson Kante then Kovacic, Bergkamp and Messi. Up front we have Mbappé. Quite a strong squad, especially since this is an RTG. Although there could be some more TOTS players at this current stage. Something that you could do is upgrade Semedo by either using his headliner version or by getting Kappa for example. He also has a pretty good card. That would be something that you could do. Yeah, and I think this is the only change that I would make at the current moment. What you could do potentially is upgrade Kante again to Sisoko for birthday 
would be an option, but other than that, uh, I don't think I would change anything at the moment. You could use uh, Benyeda for Mbappé, but I don't know whether I would personally do it. It's not the option. This is uh, what you could do here. With this squad, let's uh, check out the next one, which is from Josh. He uh, follows me and says, hashtag FIFA, hashtag YouTube. All the goals are tradable. I don't really have a budget, just under 150 to 200k. All right. So in goal, we have Ariola, then we have Walker Laporte, Longley as well well as uh, cliche in the midfield we have Kuman. then we have Kruse and Henderson up front we have Ayose Paris and then we have to uh, Son. <laughs> we have a uh, Son, and then we have money it's actually his gold card so uh, yeah this is his team and uh, at the first glance it looks like a good one so I like that you included Kruse here although he isn't on full cam so yeah this is something to change maybe so maybe put like a like a Premier League player here that fits the team although any uh, Premier League player would fit it so maybe Kovacic instead of a cruiser would be an option although then it would be a little bit too defensive maybe yeah you would need an attacking player from the Premier League who is central for a small budget so that's a difficult one so someone you could get would be Mares Mares the shapeshifter version at the moment 200,000 he would fit the team and personally I like Mares a lot that would be an option instead of a cruiser other than that maybe get another keeper like uh, Loris for example I would prefer him over Ariola. This would be it for this team and we'll check out the next one. Which is from Zach Evans. He follows me and supports Coventry City. He says, everyone's untradeable apart from Zoma and Ginter. I've got a 350,000 budget. Keep up the good work. Thank you for Ace Bud for helping out and we'll check out his team. Ingo, we have Zoma. Then we have Hakimi, Alaba, Ginter as well as Maldini. In the midfield we have Kent, then Henderson, Thiago, Eusebio, as well as Gnabry. Up front, we have, up front we have Jamie Madison. Yeah, this is uh, the team. Catania ACA is uh, this team's name. Also interesting picks on the bench. Alison, uh, then Adama, as well as Cruze and uh, Santi Cazola. Yeah, what could you do? I personally wouldn't play Zoma in FIFA. You could put in Neuer. This is uh, one thing uh, that you could change easily. I'll put in Gulashi Tots would be another option. Other than that, I actually like this team. A lot of interesting players. I haven't seen that Madison a lot. So this is kind of a cool thing. Also that you included Kent here. I don't think I would change a lot in this team. Maybe get another center back. Maybe someone like uh, Boateng, uh, for example. That would be one option. Or Mukiele that would also be a really good option here. These would be the changes. I don't know, maybe Thiago, you could change him depending on what you do with the center backs you can also keep them if you put in Boateng then they would fit if you take another one if you take Mukiele or something then you would have to change Thiago if you want to keep the chemistry keep in mind <laughs> that you need to change Thiago out potentially if you take out your center back but uh, yeah this is something that you could do in any case or Totsukulashi and improve this position oh yeah actually Hernandez foot birthday is also a, re a good idea so you could put in and put him instead of Ginter or instead of Alaba. That would be something. I also thought of Zabitza, but I don't know whether whether he's done him or not. That would be something that you could do if you have Zabitza and then you can put in Mokiele. This is it about this team and we'll check out the next one. So the next team is from Cameron. He follows me and says, Hashtag Shishif, Hashtag Xbox Share. Hi guys, it's my team. Tradables, just Gabriel, need a CDM and I'll, pay, I'll play him on 7 chemistry at right mid. Thanks in advance. All right. And here, 500,000 for CDM. Ingo, we have Ter Stegen, then we have Ramos, Cavajal, also Boateng and Davies. In the midfield we have Rafa, then we have Gabriel, then Butragenio and Coutinho. Up front we have Richarlison. And here you need a CDM player. Yeah, there are not a lot of right mid players that can play defensively, so yeah, you could play someone off cam. One thing that you could do is get Makalele, as he is the best winger uh, uh, with the defensive stats. I used to play him as a right back for a long time and he actually performed quite good although his stats aren't as good for uh, for a right back uh, when it comes to defense but he did a good job so I can show you Makalele I gave him a shadow this doesn't look uh, that well but he performs good or he performed good so I actually uh, liked him <laughs> on the on the right back position and then you could put uh, Ramos as a CDM you could play him I personally do it with the Tots version and 
I think he's a really good CDM actually. If you want to get a CDM here, then yeah, you could get a Casemiro or someone. He would fit with Coutinho and Ramos, but I don't know whether I would play Casemiro off cam as he is quite slow. Another option of course would be to put Kimmich over here and then play him as a well as a CDM or as a, as a right back which is his natural position that would link uh, to Coutinho would be another option. This is it for this team. If you have other ideas let us know in the comments down below and we will check out the next one which is from Cooper Smith. He follows me and uh, has a YouTube channel so let's check it out. V Smitty. All right he does some uh, Fortnite content on there and uh, yeah, we'll check out his team. So first of all, he says, I have 350,000 at the moment. Untradables are everyone. I run a four triple two in-game suggestions. Uh, love the vids. Thank you. Thank you, A-Spot, for helping out. And we'll check out his squad. Ingo, we have Fandaza. Then we have Bellerin. Also, we have Laporte as well as Iero and Regilon. In the midfield, we have Sancho. Then we have Witzel, Saul, Butragenio, as well as Bergwijn. Up front, we have Zabitza. Smitty FC is this team's name. 185 is this team's rating and overall it looks like quite a good team everyone is on full cam as far as i can see so interestingly linked with uh, with saul here with uh, two uh, with the with the two spanish icons a lot of objective players with laporte and zabitza also saul and witzel as spc cards there isn't a lot that i would do here i think it looks like a pretty good team maybe iero this is a position that you could improve upon maybe Maybe someone like, yeah, Tots Ramos, but he might be too expensive. What is his budget again? 350,000 at the moment. Yeah, Ramos is definitely <laughs> out of budget. A spot says, A spot says, uh, get Van Dijk instead of Laporte. That would also work. But in any ways, uh, the defenders or the center backs are the positions that I would change. If you maybe have good pulls in the weekend league or something, I would go for Ramos probably. But Van Dijk is also a really good idea here for Laporte would also upgrade your team although I think Eero is the weaker one of these two uh, defenders. This is it for this team. If you have other ideas, let us know in the comments down below. This is it for this week's episode. I hope you liked this version of this show and well if you did then leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so and I would say see you next time. Sheesh. Sheesh.